Hello, Namaste, welcome back into the sixth presentation of Interactive Hindi and in this presentation what I'm going to tell you is use of verb while saying I like this, I like that, alright? We already learned like I like this thing, I like this, that thing, you know, the nouns thing, everything we learned but now we're going to we're going to say I like to do that action, I like to do that verb, you know, that, that, that particular thing like I like to dance, I like to sing, oh, I like to do this, I like to do that he like to do this, you know, he like to, you know, anything like, like the accent things, right? How to say that we like that action in Hindi. Alright, so here we have like to plus infinitive verb, right? Um, the structure of the sentence will be like subject plus like to plus verb in the infinitive form and then object, right? It will be something like... Uh, I like to play football or you can say I love to play football it's it's in the uh, based on the uh, based on the habit or nature of a person right or or thing you know uh, so it's not like uh, somebody is offering um, somebody is offering something oh yeah I like to do that or I, I love to play football not in that sense but in the sense of telling your habit oh yeah I love to play football man I really like football. You you you're talking about your habit, okay? In, in that sense, what you like, what you don't like, your likes likes and dislikes you're talking about in the accent format, like which accent you like, which accent you don't like, or about anybody, right? Uh, what they like, what they don't like, in that sense. Football. <laughs> so mujhe football khelna pasand hai. Before explaining anything, let me tell you one more thing here. The two infinity verb in Hindi language will be always ending with na at the last like khelna, kudna, ghumna, firna, chalna, khana, everything na ending, right? Uh, root form plus na, right? Root form of the verb plus na will make two infinity verb, alright? Like mujhe football khelna, now khel plus na, khelna, khel means uh, uh, game and then and then khelna means to play, right? So Mujhe football khelna pasand hai. Pasand hai will be always same, right? And before that, we have to put a verb, right? Remember that. Verb in the infinity form. Mujhe football khelna pasand hai. Mujhe basketball khelna pasand hai. Mujhe volleyball khelna pasand hai. Like that, okay? Kite. Mujhe patang udana bahut pasand hai. Remember again, bahut pasand hai means very much, right? You like very much. Mujhe patang udana. Udana. Udana is the verb and again then Bahut Pasand hai. Alright? The, the Pasand hai or Bahut Pasand hai. Sabse jada Pasand hai. Or Had se jada Pasand hai. This will be always same, you know? How how you wanna express that? How much how much you like that? How much burning desire you have for that? So before that you have to put the verb. Right? Mujhe patang udana bahut pasand hai. Mujhe roj terna pasand hai. I like to swim every day. You know, this is my habit. Like I like, it's my nature. I love to swim every day, you know. I like to swim every day. Mujhe roz tairna pasand hai. Roz, uh, roz is uh, not that roz, right? Roz means every day, right? Remember that. Yeah, it's a good trick. Roz means every day. You have to give rose to your girlfriend every day or her boyfriend. <sighs> what should I say more? Anil ko ice cream khana bahut hi jyada pasand hai. I like like Anil likes to eat ice cream very very much for me like mujhe ice cream khana bahut hi jyada pasand hai sabse jyada pasand hai had se jyada pasand hai duniya mein mujhe ice cream khana sabse jyada pasand hai sabse jyada pasand the most in the world right but here now Anil as a third person I'm talking right Anil ko Whenever you're taking a name, now this is the uh, this is the first thing. Till this time, I always described as mujhe or mujko. I, I took I as example, but now I'm taking the example uh, of some persons, right? Or some other pronoun, okay? So, when you take, when you put a third person, then you have to add always ko after that, right? Anil ko, or it, uh, now it is ko, but sometimes it may be ke, can be ki. So, ka, ke, ki will be added after the name let's not get confused let's go to the subject anil ko ice cream khana bahut hi pasand hai anil ko anil ko like to anil i'm talking all right anil ko ice cream khana bahut hi pasand hai 
Now, papa ko, you can see here. Papa is the third person here. Dad, you know. Papa ko, bahasaye sikhna pasand hai. Bahasaye sikhna pasand hai. Bahasaye means languages. Sikhna means to learn, right? Pasand hai. He likes, right? So, dad likes to learn languages. So, ko is coming. Remember that when we bring a third person. Papa ko, bahasaye sikhna pasand hai. Mummy ko khana pakana pasand hai. Khana pakana, right? To cook food, khana pakana, like cooking food, you know. So, mummy ko khana pakana pasand hai. Behen ko chitra banana pasand hai. Behen ko chitra banana pasand hai. Like my sister, you know, sister likes to do drawing, you know. She likes drawing. So, behen ko chitra banana pasand hai. Bhai ko बॉक्सिंग सीखना पसंद है भाई को भाई को मेंस ब्रदर एक्चुअली माय ब्रदर लाइक्स लाइक दैट यू नो सो ब्रदर लाइक्स टू लर्न बॉक्सिंग यू नो सो भाई को बूम बॉक्सिंग सीखना पसंद है रिमेम्बर इट हाउ आई एम डेलीवरिंग इट ओके नेक्स्ट वन मेरी बहन अलीसा को गाना गाना बहुत ही पसंद है Meri bahan Alisa ko. Now see the subject how I'm changing. Meri bahan Alisa ko. Like, Mere papa ko bhasa sikhna pasand hai. Here, what I can make? Mere papa ko. Like, my dad. Right? Similarly here. Meri bahan. Right? Meri bahan Alisa ko. Remember, ko is following here everywhere, you know? Meri bahan Alisa ko gana gana bahut pasand hai. Bahut hi pasand hai. Like, she likes very much. Weird, very weird, weirdo. <laughs> if she will watch this video, she is going to laugh. <laughs> Abhyas, exercise, alright? Let's do it. Translate the following sentences. I like to dance. Hint, for dance, uh, to dance, in Hindi we say nachna, right? Nachna. I like to cook chicken very much. <laughs> to cook we say pakana, chicken we say murga, right? And now, male is called murga and female chicken is called murgi. So, uh, what you're going to cook, <laughs> decide yourself. Uh, <laughs> Emma likes to listen romantic songs. Really? Emma, really? Do you like to listen romantic songs? What about my songs? <laughs> okay, so to listen, we say sunna, right? It's uh, together we used to write, but like if you pronounce this as an English person then sunna it will be sunna word but but pronounce like sunna right sunna mujhe gana sunna pasand hai right so Emma likes to listen romantic songs you have to translate it songs we say gane song means gana songs means gane in the plural form okay remember it she likes to work for Google I like to she likes to work for Google right so to work we say kaam karna काम करना, she we say वो, she is called वो और he is also वो, right? He likes to work for Google, or you can also write like I like to work for Google, and he likes to work for Google. So write those all things in the comment section below. That's your practice point, you know. Your notebook, your exercise book, right? So we like to eat vegetarian foods. So hint, vegetarian foods we say साकाहारी खाना because we're going to learn to connect two sentences. Positive.